everyone welcome to vlogtober day 17 um one more day until the padstow cardigan by victoria marchant is released i'm so excited so i have my wool uh ready and i have my floof on its way so i shall be starting that as soon as i can i will do a swatch um because i um have not knitted with mohair and uh four ply together before on such large gauge so i'm so excited anyway enough of that um so today is the 17th um i'm in the studio as you can see um i've got a busy day ahead um around some college work um, i need to wind this wool um for a project for christmas i've got um some stuff to do around the embroideries guild um project as well so yeah busy old day i'll try and show you bits of it as we go okay see you later <laughs> and chutney toasty homemade for my lunch then i'm going to do 20 minutes of cross stitch yeah nice lunch time the guilt that they try and instill in you because you're eating your lunch good guys yeah so this one is janice and this one is Ika. he's naughty he steals everything um, so I've had quite a productive day. Um, I've been working on the college work and we have been doing about um, image transfer. I put in um, photographic images or maps or any kind of image really onto fabric. Last week we used um, an inkjet printer and um, some freezer paper ready for us to kind of stitch into and embellish this week. So these are two images that I took in Scotland um, last year. So those are there. And we were also given one on transfer paper to have a go at and see what we wanted to kind of try out in techniques at home. So I used this today and I popped it onto some white um, cotton and I've just stitched around the tops of the mountains. And then I've done an applique stag's head just as a practice. It's not very good. My um, machine had a bit of a moment with the thread that I was using um, and snagged a couple of times. So that's not the best quality but it'll, it's fine it's for a practice piece and then this is using water soluble clear fabric and i've just drawn with the machine um a golden eagle's head so tomorrow i will use the machine to freely embroider this in um i will hand embroider maybe parts of it probably the beak hand embroider um in and then use it as a practice piece for the ongoing assignment so yeah um i love my college course it's it's it is a huge trek, um, particularly when I'm not feeling well. If you've seen yesterday's video, you'll understand kind of where I'm coming from with fatigue. Um, if I'm struggling, then sometimes I will ask um, a fellow student who lives locally if we can lift share. Um, but she likes to take the train, but the train also involves a nearly mile walk all up hill. So that is problematic as well if I want to take the train. So. Um, I tend to drive and just take it in. Um, it, it's just over an hour. It's not too far. Um, so it's fine, really, as long as I'm feeling okay. Um, still haven't wound this. I'm going to do it in a minute. Uh, we have to get the wool winder and the swift down from up on the shelf. So I'm just going to do that. Put the ironing board away. And then we've got um, a casserole cooking, beef casserole for the carnivores of the house and a corn chicken casserole for the vegetarians of the house. There are three of each. Um, and so we've got that with some crusty bread for dinner and then tonight is Thursday so today is library night um, 
if you're new here you won't know that every thursday um our local library opens till half past seven at night so we um as a family go to the library ethan not so much at the moment he's revising for gcse so he kind of stays at home where all his books are but myself monty matt my mum all go to the library um dad dog sits and we tend to go to the library have a cup of tea um monty always has cake matt always has cake mum and i sometimes have cake um and just enjoy the time at the library together um and choose your books so yes uh monty has just finished a, he's um a fanatical reader and has discovered a new series but he's now reached the end of that series and um the latest book has only literally just been released which he's now devoured and so now he's looking for a new series so um yeah we're off there tonight to try and find something that piques his interest a little bit so yeah um i'll try and take you along for that and see you later Thank mm -hmm. you.